This is my winter broccoli. This will give me at least 30 portions of my uh, daily veg. So I can eat from the leaf to the to the trunk. And all you got to do is to take your time and pick it. This is what I pick and my hand is frozen but you got to see how I cook it and you shall enjoy it if you got any of this don't waste it, eat it these are the winter broccoli I grow from summer last year these are all the little sprout you can eat the young sprout and these are the leaves you can eat them all might be a bit tough but it's not that tough that you can break your teeth. Obviously, it's so delicious, especially to just pick from the garden and you can enjoy the taste, the, the freshness, and no harm, you can grow in a pot, you can grow on the ground, you can grow by your patio. You can have lots of ways to cook winter sprout and lots of way to get the production. Imagine I can have more than 20 meals from my garden without thinking what a vitamins that I can get and what a, uh, what a delicious way of enjoying your everyday food or your Sunday lunch. Just pick them fresh. Anytime from morning till night got fresh vegetables. What are you wondering why I put a bit of salt in it? Just only a pinch of salt in the water. So that when you boil your vegetables, it's going to keep it clean and beautiful. You can see there is salt in the water and the green, the darker green of the veg in first because it gets it softer and if you don't like the stock don't use them for us Chinese we eat everything but not everybody's flavor of the, salt, of the stock not everybody flavor of the stock now we put the veg can you see it's boiling beautifully and it's washed well. Sprinkle as much water out of the vegetables. Can you see it's still keeping green and beautiful. Don't throw any of the leaves away. Eat them, they are delicious. They are really delicious. Now we can throw the water away. We cook this vegetable in boiling water for one minute, okay? One minute, so it's 60 seconds. If you count 60 seconds in a hot boiling water, and what you do? Drain them out with your chopstick or your ladle. And if you want to you keep the water for stock when you cook something else you can if we want to make tea with this water you can because uh, they all got lots of minerals inside you can make, you, can, you can even make a cup of coffee imagine that what creates delicious food now I'm going to mix two teaspoons of olive oil. One, two, and two teaspoons of oyster sauce. Oops. One, two. And don't tell me my food is salty. It's not. Whisk them, make a bit of noise. You twist them. Then you twist them. 
go around it and the rest put on the top and don't waste anything this is homemade boy broccoli with drizzle of olive oil and oyster sauce and as fresh as ever from the garden these are homemade delicious vegetables 